The next Shadowlands mount we're going to be talking about is the Shimmer Mist Runner, which is another horned horse, and so not the most interesting thing in the world, but it is another mount to your collection. It is a guaranteed drop if you do things correctly, and the acquisition method for it is fairly interesting as well. So to get things started, you'll want to be max level, so level 60, and head over to Ardenweald. In the west end of Ardenweald, you'll find the Mist Veil Tangle, and if you head over to the basically the very edge you'll find a mob called Shizgear which is an elite level 6 there but once you enter the area it'll kind of phase out or despawn it kind of seems like it's bugged honestly but that's not the case it just means you've not done things correctly so if we head back to the start of the Mist Veil Tangle and you'll find kind of three entrances here there'll be a map here for the starting point and it's basically a maze you have to make your way through the maze correctly otherwise the mob won't be visible so if you want to try it yourself feel free and then in a second, I'm going to give you a little bit of a hint, and then I'm going to run through the full solution. So the hint is going to be blue. And then in terms of the full solution, you need to follow these blue lanterns that are hanging around. So you'll want to make your way to the start. You'll have the left, the front, and the right entrance. And we'll want to go through the left entrance because that's where we can see the first set of lights. You'll head down here, and you'll find these mushrooms as well, these bounding dusk shrooms. Jump on these because they're going to make your, your way less detectable. So you can make it your way through this area. Take your first right. Once again, we can see the blue lights. And then your first left. You'll see over there there's purple lanterns. We don't want to go through those. And then from here, you'll take your first right again. Once again, blue lantern. And you'll see blue, uh, purple and red lanterns. Don't go through those ones, only blue. And we'll have these three entrances here. We want to take the third one, the one on the far right. And then finally, we'll take the middle entrance and we'll be in the area where Shiz gear can be found. And once you've done this correctly once, it doesn't seem to matter anymore. You've kind of permanently unlocked the phase, so you don't need to do it perfectly every single time you want to come here if you want to help someone or something. So this is an elite. It's going to be quite difficult at 60. These characters aren't crazy geared though, so you don't need to be insanely geared. You just need to be kind of like normal slash heroic dungeon geared to be able to do this. One thing though is during the fight, he will make all of these neutral elites in the area aggro. So before you begin the fight, unless you're here with friends, I would recommend killing them all, if you're here solo especially. Get them all killed, and then try and take on Shiz gear. During the fight, the only thing you really need to know is to try and interrupt the shrink as much as possible, as that makes you take more damage or deal less damage, I can't remember which way around it is. And then the, the mob is fully CCable as well, if you have things like trap or paralysis, you can put it in things like that and reset yourself if needed. Once it's dead, you'll be able to click on the horse and get yourself the mount. And it does seem like anyone who takes part in the fight will be able to click the horse and get themselves the mount. It just seems like anyone who comes along after it's been killed, if they didn't do any damage, they won't be able to click on the horse. In terms of respawn time, I camped it three times and each respawn was below two hours. So I'm going to say a one to two, maybe a one to three hour respawn as I didn't get anything over that. So it would be unlikely it's very long. But remember, this is beta, so things are subject to change. And that's it. That's all you need to know. Do the path correctly, make your way to Shiz Gear, and then kill it. Click on the horse, and you'll get yourself that Shimmer Mist Runner. I want to give a quick shout out to the Secret Finding Discord. It's a great place to be for WoW stuff, mounts. You can get alerts and all that jazz. So there'll be a link in the description down below. So those people over there were the ones that figured this out. Especially someone over there called Unholy was the one who put the majority of this info together. And I'm normally fairly good with some of the secret stuff, but this one, I straight up thought it was bugged. I even put in a bug report because of the weird phasing stuff, which is kind of embarrassing in hindsight. But I even managed to pull Shiz Gear out of its area and kill it in an area that wasn't phased. And I was like, yeah, this is bugged. I'll come back to it later. But turns out I was just a uh, drunk. So outside of that, look out for more videos coming soon. Thanks for watching, guys. See ya.